Hey everybody, today we decided we are going to hit up the Santan Village and do some filming over here, see what pops we can find. We're going to start at this comic store. This is Atomic Comics. Never been there before. I heard there's a lot of pops though. We're going to head inside, see what they got, and then we're going to hit up the other stores here at Santan Village. Hit the music, hit the title, let's go everybody. So the kids pointed out that there's some pretty cool anime pops down here like this Hollow Ichigo from Bleach. Uh, that's a really nice one. I've never seen that before. People are kind of loud in here. We're going to try to be as uh, as loud as we can. We got uh, some Hot Topic exclusives from My Hair Academia. Uh, Glow in the Dark All Might, Silver Age All Might. That's pretty cool. Now let's go around over here see what we got. This is a really cool one. Infinite Deku. That pop came out really nice. That's one of the 10-inch ones. Let's see what we have down here. Wide variety of stuff, especially if you're an anime fan. Definitely a lot of My Hero Academia. And then we even have some over here on the wall. Starting with All Might up here on the top, another 10-inch. And just work our way down. Some pretty nice stuff. We're going to head over now and check out the uh, wall of pops and see what they have on there. Got a lot of stuff up here on the wall. A lot of different pops, a lot of Star Wars on this side. But uh, I was checking this out, this is really cool. Uh, for all you Game of Thrones fans, it's definitely a really nice uh, movie moment, or I guess TV show moment. And then I saw this one down here, Duck Dodgers, the 2016 summer exclusive. That's a really nice pop. Uh, there's a lot of nice pops down here. Obviously the ones in the case are a little bit more pricey, but this store definitely has some really cool pops. I'm glad we came in and checked it out. So we're going through the store and we found some pops that Dean wanted to show off. Dean, which one did you want to show us today? Um, I wanted to show R2-D2, um, the Smuggler's Bounty exclusive. Um, it's when he's giving drinks to uh, all the Sith when they take them. Um, this one's really awesome. I think it's just a really cool pop. Yeah, that is a really nice pop. I really do like that one. We also got some Star Wars ones over here. We got our... Uh, Smuggler's Bounty movie moment, which is really cool, and then uh, I really like Luke on with his speeder. That one came out really nice. These are all pops that would be awesome to add to any Star Wars collection. Uh, Darth Vader and the Snow Trooper, that's a really nice combo, um, Amazon exclusive as well, so definitely some nice finds in here. We just left Atomic Comics, and we're over here now. We got a Hot Topic, and we got a Grace Records. We're going to head inside. They both have pops in them, so let's see what they've got stocked. All right, so we're inside Hot Topic. A lot of the same stuff. Here's our Ghost album that we got last time. Uh, what else do we got? I wanted to show these off. These are really cool. These are the Hex Girls from Scooby-Doo. These are a Hot Topic exclusive. They came out at Halloween. These are a really nice trio of pops there. And then over here, you have uh, Stitch and Angel, the Christmas set, also a Hot Topic exclusive. And uh, that's a really nice pair right there. Other than that, it's mostly stuff we've seen before, so we're gonna hop on over to the next store. All right, so we're inside Grace Records. I want to show off some of these records. We got uh, Black Sabbath right here, which is a really cool one. I haven't seen that one in person before. We also got Motorhead's Ace of Spades. That's definitely a cool album pop to have. And then over here on the carousel, there are a lot of different pops I like. We got uh, Port Chop from Doug, which was a Disney slash Nickelodeon series. Fire Troll from Game of Thrones. That's actually really cool. I haven't seen that one in person before. Uh, we got Dennis Nedry for all you Jurassic Park fans. It's one of my favorite movies, if not my favorite movie. So that one's definitely really cool to see. Um, we got Doug Funny, which is something that I'm actually looking for. I may be picking this up today if they don't have the Quail Man. This would be awesome to get signed. What else do we got over here? Um, for all you Nickelodeon fans, we also got Norbit from Angry Beavers. That's a really cool pop to see. 2017 fall exclusive Ickis from All Real Monsters. A lot of Nickelodeon pops in here, so this is definitely a really cool selection. We're going to keep going around, see what else we can find in here. All right, guys, we hit up a couple stores already. Now we're going to jump into Barnes and Nobles. Kind of hard to see the sign, but they usually have a pop section. The one by my house doesn't have a lot of pops, so let's head inside and see if they have some here. Hopefully they do. So they still have a pop section, but it is pretty small. Unfortunately, nothing that we're really looking for here. Uh, this is a cool... Green Hornet 2 pack. It's a 2019 Fall Convention Limited Edition pack. So, wanted to show that off and uh, see if there's anything else. Uh, I do know that 
the Alice in Wonderland pops are very popular right now. Uh, there's the white rabbit, and then you've got Alice doing her curtsy. Other than that, there's nothing really here that uh, we're too interested in. There's the section for you if there's anything you want to look at. But uh, we're going to head out of Barnes and Nobles and hit up the next store. <laughs> All right, Dean, where are we? We are at Walmart. You had to look up there and see it, didn't you? He forgot. We are uh, still in the Santan Village area. I've never been to this Walmart, so we're going to run inside and see if they have anything. Hopefully, they got a nice section for us. Let's go. So our worst nightmares come true. They have not stocked this section, it looks like, in a while. Uh, not really anything here, but Dean is a Star Wars fan. What'd you find, Dean? Uh, I found Babu Free. Um, this pop, um, I'm not really a big fan of him, but um, he was in the movie, The Rise of Skywalker, and um, I thought that was a pretty good movie. Yeah, but... it's a pretty cool pop, and he is a 10-inch, which is nice. Um, I haven't seen one in a couple weeks now. I think that they've sold out pretty much, so it is nice to find one still. And if you are a Star Wars fan, it's always cool to find a 10-inch. Um, other than that, we haven't really showed off the uh, zombie Captain America from What If. Uh, that's a nice pop. Um, and then we got, you know, the Rocks over here, his art series, Walmart exclusive. We already have that. Um, we don't really have anything else. Pretty dead section, so we're not going to end the video with this store. Let's head to another one so we can uh, try to wrap it up with some good pops. All right, guys, we didn't really find anything at Walmart, so we're going to hit up this Target I haven't been to, but hopefully we'll end the day here, and uh, maybe the birds are a good sign. You hear them all over the place. Uh, hopefully there'll be some stuff here since that Walmart was pretty bad. This should be our last stop of the day. Let's go inside, check it out. All right, so here's the section back here at Target, and it's uh, pretty stocked. There's some pretty cool stuff. You got the 25th anniversary uh, chrome Bulbasaur. Uh, that's a really nice pop. Haven't seen those often. Um, you got the Donatello. Um, I haven't seen the Donatello Ninja Turtle art series yet. Those are Target exclusives, so that's pretty cool. Uh, Dean picked out a pop he liked. Which one you got, Dean? Um, Luke Skywalker. Um, is he the Mandalorian pop when he takes Baby Yoda. Um, I actually like this pop a lot. Um, it's in good. The box is in very good condition too. So yeah, this yeah, pop. Is that's a really definitely nice a pop. cool one, especially really if you're nice. a Skywalker fan. That's him with Grogu. There it is again if you want to see a more still version of it. A very nice pop. And then they also have the Target exclusive Luke Skywalker based off of the comic book. And there's the comic book right there. Um, and these ones are really cool. I do like them. They did have four of these come out. So that's definitely one that I think we will pick up today. Um, other than that, though, that's all the hunting we're going to do today, guys. Make sure you guys follow us on Instagram at az underscore pop hunter. And if you guys enjoy our videos, we will be posting another one early next week. We'll be going out hunting again. Uh, subscribe to the channel. Like the videos. Comment if you guys want. Tell me what you guys are looking for. And again, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.